Today on Happiest Camper, we are going to show you how to sew this peplum top with free pattern. Download the free printable pattern linked in the description to cut out your fabric pieces. Let's get started. Start this peplum top sewing tutorial by transferring your darts from the pattern to the bodice. Cut a notch mark at the end of the dart. Fold the fabric at the dart right sides together. Align the notch marks and pin. Continue folding the dart along the marked lines and pin. Now, head over to your sewing machine and sew the dart from the hem, leaving long threads. When you are finished sewing, tie the threads to secure the dart. Repeat for all the darts on the front and back bodice pieces. On the front bodice with right sides together, pin the main fabric and the facing right sides together at the neckline and sew. Clip the seams in the curves Turn the facing to the wrong side of the bodice. This will help it lay flat. Repeat the same steps for the back facing and back bodice pieces. Next, ensure that the facing is folded to the wrong side for both the front and back bodice pieces. Pin the front and the back together, aligning the shoulders Sew them together.
Now with right sides together, pin the front and back bodice together at the side seams and sew. To hem the sleeves, double fold the fabric one half of an inch or use your serger and finish the raw edges. You will finish the raw edges of the facing and the back bodice seam. Next, we will add the sleeves to our peplum top. With right sides together, pin the sleeve to the armhole and sew. Be sure that the narrower part of the sleeve is pinned at the underarm. You may need to fold small gathers at the shoulder sleeve to get the sleeve to fit. Sew the sleeve to the armhole. Repeat these steps for the other sleeve. Now, we will work on putting the skirt and bodice pieces together. Divide the skirt in quarters. Place the skirt and the bodice right sides together. Pin the first and last skirt quarter marks to the bodice side seams and pin the center skirt mark between the front bodice darts. Make small pleats in the skirt and pin it to the bodice. Sew the skirt to the bodice. With the back of the bodice right sides up and your zip wrong side up, 
pin the zipper to the left-hand side of the bodice, ensuring the zipper stop is in line with the top of the bodice. Attach a regular zipper foot to your sewing machine and sew the zipper to the bodice, sewing as close as possible to the zipper teeth. With the zipper closed, align the other side of the zipper and the bodice, ensuring both sides of the bodice line up. Place one pin to secure it. Open the zipper and continue pinning the zipper to the bodice. Sew the zipper to the bodice, again sewing as close as possible to the zipper teeth. Close the zipper and pin the rest of the skirt from where the zipper ends to the skirt hem. Sew Trim your zipper if it was longer than what you need. We will hem the skirt the same way we hemmed the sleeves, by double folding the skirt fabric by one half of an inch. Sew to finish. Lastly, trim off the zipper overhang at the top of the bodice or fold over the wrong side and hand baste in place. And that's it! Now you know how to make a peplum top with free pattern. If you enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on our latest sewing content. We love bringing you this type of content, so be sure to let us know in the comments what you want to see in the future. Thanks for watching.